Do you know how much horsepower it takes for your engine to spin a 30 pound steel clutch fan? It's more than you might think. So it would make sense that eliminating the factory fan for a lightweight cooling system, you can return as much as 27 horsepower and 34 pounds feet of torque with improved cooling. To understand more about how an electric fan system can actually give your truck more power, we spoke with one of the leaders in the cooling business, Flexilite Consolidated, located in Milton, Washington. The company's president, Lisa Chizes, explains how Flexilite sees itself as a performance company rather than a cooling company. People um, who know about Flexilite know about us for our cooling products, but really we're a performance company. Uh, a cooling fan, yes it cools the radiator, but the principle about the fans we produce is that it will give you additional horsepower. So whether or not it's a flex fan that flexes out at higher engine RPMs or an electric fan that completely eliminates the clutch fan and clutch assembly, um, either one is going to give you additional horsepower at the wheels for your application. In order to free up more power from your engine, Flexilite designed a low-profile fan that is made from injection-molded, glass-reinforced nylon that is strong, yet lightweight and flexible enough to withstand constant vibration and high heat. Flexilite's engineering technician, Bill Stock, explains more. Well, the benefits with replacing a heavy clutch fan is turning it into a... Um, what you're doing is you're taking the weight of a clutch fan off of the engine, so that way the engine doesn't have to labor the extra weight of a clutch fan. What it does is it eliminates that weight and the wear and tear on that, so you're replacing it with the electric fan, which is completely separate from the engine, and the only draw that's running that is uh, amperage from your alternator. One example of Flexilite's cooling systems is their new Model 262 fan. This fan system features a burst aluminum shroud and is designed for diesel pickups that undergo heavy-duty towing conditions and require large amounts of cooling. It also features a variable speed control unit, making it smarter than your factory clutch fan. Stock explains. The electronics comes with a variable speed control unit, um, or VSC. What it does is it allows you the adjustment option of uh, setting your temperature. As long as you read the directions thoroughly, you can set your temperature where you want it within the range of your vehicle. So how difficult is it to install a dual fan system? According to Stock, the average enthusiast can do it in a matter of hours. With someone who's experienced with this sort of product, probably take them three to four hours. Probably take six to eight hours from someone who doesn't have a lot of experience with it. But definitely get a buddy to do it and two people could do it on a weekend. The Flexilite engineering team demonstrated how easy the number 262 fan system installs on a Dodge diesel pickup. The procedures of installing the fan, you're going to have to remove the clutch fan. You're going to have to remove the factory shroud, uh, the uh, radiator overflow tank, the uh, windshield wash overflow reservoir. Our kit, the 262, is a direct replacement for that shroud. So it'll drop right in and fit right where the factory shroud did. So you'll be using the factory mounting points, uh, to hold it in, so you, there's no drilling required. That's a complete direct, direct fit install. It's quite evident that reducing the resistance of the OEM clutch fan can easily free up some more horsepower and torque. In some of Flexilite's dyno testing, as much as 27 horsepower and 34 pounds feet of torque can be made available, as well as a one mile per gallon improvement in fuel economy. With numbers like these, we're convinced that an electric fan system is a performance bolt-on item. For more information on the complete line of Flexalite products, log on to flexalite.com.